Hey guys, this is Froggy2K9 and today I'm bringing you some MW2 with an intervention. Now this is my attempt, awful, awful, awful attempt at a slightly aggressive sniper gameplay. Team now the reason I say it's awful is because I'm not a sniper in any way, shape or form. I find them fun to use, especially in World of War. World of War was one of the only ones that I could ever snipe in. Uh, Springfield was a brilliant weapon when you put a scope on it, take the scope off, it became a piece of crap. Or at least in my opinion it did. Especially in zombies. Wow, that thing was bad. So at the beginning I, I just get a quick death because I, I play Ring Around the Rosies for some reason. I don't know what was going through my mind at the time, but yeah, you know, Ring Around the Rosies is fun. There I get my first kill. As you can see I'm no quick scoper or no scoping crap and stuff like that. But generally when I take a shot, You'll see me either uh, back off or lie down. Or so I'll do something like I'll zoom out, take a look around my surroundings, and then I'll and then I'll zoom back in once I get my once I get my bearings on. So I pick up his ACR here because I know I'm going to be hitting him in close combat, and there's no way I'm going to be able to burst him with an intervention or a pistol. So the machine gun was my best bet, or the assault rifle. Uh, the assault rifle is my best bet there, but I uh, I just played it badly. So as you can see there, that's my. Uh, prime examples of backing off after I take a shot. Uh, I got a bit too aggressive there and I heard him but I should have stayed aimed down the sight and I probably would have got the kill. So there if I had stayed aimed down the sight I probably would have killed him. But whenever I aim down sight generally I will hold my breath straight away which is not really a good idea. Only hold him if you was to ask me what should I do then I'd say hold your breath only when you know you're gonna get a kill or when you or when you can actually see someone. Right there, I don't really know too much about what happened there. It was uh, just something. And there, I just got too aggressive. And I always get angry. And I'm going to do some bad plays when I get angry. Always happens. Always happens. Catch a sniper. This guy has a shotgun and all crap. Got blown over my face. Um, I think it's not here. But in a bit, you're going to see me... Uh, see me do some pretty good sniping until the auto aim assist gets me out. So I catch this guy down by the police car. That's what happens when you call the police. You get shot in the face by a sniper. How nice is that? Anyway, I thought they had spawned the flip there, but uh, clearly I was wrong. I thought they had uh, started spawning over there because my entire team was down by the airplane and stuff, but you know. You get wrong sometimes, you get wrong sometimes. Uh, catch that guy trying to uh, jump over to the wing, I believe it was, or you just like run at an angle and missed it. Uh, somehow I missed that knife, don't know why. These things happen. Uh, here's a bit of, uh, here's me getting a bit more defensive. I got angry, so I tried to calm down, get a, get a bit defensive, pick up at least three kills, that way I'd get. I, th I think I've got like a three kill streak. Or th by this time, I think I have the uh, five, five, seven, and nine, I believe. But there's, I knew there was no way I was going to get with a sniper rifle. I couldn't, just couldn't be bothered to change the kill streaks. Normally, I go with UAV, counter UAV, and pred. But that was because I was using a assault rifle. I'm actually all right with a assault rifle. Not brilliant, but all right. Here, I actually get a good tomahawk in. It was like a random. I actually threw it at that guy running, but I ended up hitting a guy who was like lying down. Whoop whoop be to me. I die again right here. Because uh, I was way too aggressive. I used the smoke to uh, I used the smoke to get in there. Here's a good sniper gameplay. I got two nice kills. Now I would have got this kill if my gun didn't lock on to the guy on the right. The guy jumping, my gun locked on to him, which is why it went upwards. Here I get stuck on this guy, which actually gets me killed here because I'm not paying attention to what's in front of me. I was just trying to get around the guy, getting angry at him again. I believe that uh, I get a slightly more defensive again because every time I get too aggressive, I just end up getting killed, getting killed, getting killed. So I thought, if I can get one kill streak out. I'll be happy. So I, I pull back and I start doing defensive again. This is this is what I usually do when I'm sniping. I generally won't be staying on one roof. Generally, I'll be staying in a nice nice area. Uh, you'll see me a lot of the time on this map up here. But if I'm using a sniper anyway, you'll see me a lot up here because this is a perfect sniping spot. 
you got a nice overview of the land, and if you lie down, you got one of the most perfect defenses. If they throw a grenade up, you're pretty much screwed. Anyway, that was not a very good gameplay. I don't know the score, I didn't read it too well, but here you get to see a noob tube in the action. Watch that hit his face, oh my god, it just blew him up. Congratulations, whoever you are. I came second, uh, 15 and 11, I believe that is. Is that 15 or 16?